and our weather stem time lapse from today showing some fog to kick off the morning and we had some blue sky and sunshine a little bit of rain we had some clouds we had everything except snow it's been over a thousand days since we have had snow we topped out at 76 degrees and actually bottomed out at 66 so our temperatures really did not move all too much that was our weather stem time lapse cam for you we look at our visibility or our future visibility that is and we will see some dense fog out there tomorrow morning looking at visibility to get as low as I would even say a quarter of a mile out there and if it becomes widespread enough dropping to a quarter of a mile that is when we would see a dense fog advisory issued but right now we don't have one but we certainly could I expect the fog to lift between about 9 and 11 o'clock so somewhere around 9 30 to 10 o'clock but certainly prepare for that fog tomorrow morning 65 degrees overnight tonight 66 you guys is our average high temperature so we are well above average and we still are feeling that high humidity ahead of this frontal system now this front is going to slowly sag to the south so it's going to be very warm as we head through friday into saturday we do start to cool since we'll be kind of in wake of this front but but the front is going to drop south far enough that we're actually going to get wedged in on Sunday, meaning it is going to be cool, cloudy, and that is when we're going to see that rain return Sunday heading into the day on Monday as well. So here is your day closing out the week on Friday, 81 degrees. We have a pretty calm wind out of the north northwest again in wake of that cold front. We'll see temperatures still well above average, not only above average, record breaking likely 81 degrees would tie the record if that's where we top out at. I am forecasting 81 degrees. Our record high for the day is 81, which was just set last year. Our average high though, guys, look at that. 66. The record low for the day was in 1967, which was 25 degrees. So far from that number as we head through the next several days, 81 degrees for your Friday by Saturday, 70. So we do start to cool down heading into Sunday, much cooler though. As again, we see that Carolina wedge take place. We have that cold air banking up against the mountains, so it's going to be cooler and we are expecting that rain to make a comeback again late Sunday heading into your Veterans Day. So if you do have plans, Sunday or Monday um, kind of honoring Veterans Day just heads up you might have to dodge a few showers there it does look like temperatures kind of settle back to average you guys as we head into the middle of next week beyond that rain chance Sunday into Monday it looks like we could have some showers returning by the end of next week all right thank you Kate thank you're welcome